OK. Next is to create the code to change the costume of the paper sprite in the same way. From here, let's select paper sprite and create the code. I drag a when I receive start code block under events like this. Now, let's click control and a repeat until code block is connected here. Here for the condition, a code block with the equal sign on the operators is connected. A costume number code block under looks is connected to the left side of the equal sign. Let's type the five numbers on the right side of the equal sign. Now drag a next costume code block under looks into this repeat until code block. This code block will repeat until the costume number is not equal to five. Next is to create the code to change the costumes of the player sprite in the cases where the value of the player variable is rock, paper or scissors. Here, let's drag an if code block under the control. For the condition of this if code block, connect a code block with the equal sign in the operators. Drag a player code block under variables to the left side of the equal sign. Let's give the value rock to the right side. Now I drag a switch costume to rock code block under looks into this if code block. In the same way, let's create the code for the costumes to change in both paper and scissors cases. For that, we can easily duplicate this code. I right click on this if code block and duplicate it. Let's add the duplicated code block below this if code block. I change the player's value to paper in the condition here. And by clicking on the arrow here, the costume will be changed to paper. Now let's duplicate this if code block once again. Let's change the player's value here to scissors and give scissors here. Ok, now we have completely created the rock, paper and scissors game. Now we have to save this design. I click on the file in the upper left corner of the interface and select save as. Now from here, let's browse the PictoBlocks project folder that we created on the desktop. The file name is given as project 6 and click on save. Ok. Now to see the creation you have made, WhatsApp it to the number note 7681252244. Tell your friends also about the creation. Send it to me and also send it to your friends to see this app. And one more thing, you too can now join the DP Coding School Telegram group and try to be the DP Code Champ best of the week once every week. For that, keep in touch with us. And one more thing, join our DP Coding Club and now, you can start a DP coding club in your school. We are ready to give you all the guidance for that. If you want to start a DP coding club in any school where computer labs are available, make a request through the principal to the email address info at dpcc.lk. So let's meet with another interesting lesson through DP coding school. Have a nice day.